Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel Learning Station. I hope all of you will be fine. The tongue twister that I am going to share right now is the one that I know very well. Yes, you heard it right. I do know a tongue twister very well. The tongue twister is I scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let me show you how well I know it. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. So you have seen, I can do it well. Let's see how well you can do. And it's time for recap. What we had read in the previous video is that Mr. White had gone away and Peter Jane and their father were working on his garden. Peter collected some apples in the box. They, Peter and Jane both went to a room over this table where they found many different things in a big black box. They went to another room uh, in Mr. White's house where they found a lot of books and then they came back to their father and told him what they had seen and they helped their father to build a fire by a safe place. In the end, Jane told <coughs> that uh, their friend Jack was coming to the farm for holidays. Let's read onwards. Jack has come to Pam's farm for two weeks holiday. He has a friend with him. When Peter and Jane were on their own holidays by the sea, they used to talk to Jack about Pam's farm and about the good times they had there. It made Jack want to go to the farm for a holiday. Jack and his friend have come in a van. It is Jack's uncle's van. They have a tent in it. Pam's father tells them where they can put their tent. So Jack has come to Pam's farm with his friend and they came in a van <coughs> and they have a tent in it and Pam's father tells them where they can put their tent. There are some logs by the barn. Pam's father tells the boys they can make a log house if they want to. Peter and Jane come up to the farm to see Jack. They talk to him about the happy days they had by the sea. I used to like going on the pier to fish, says Peter. Yes, and I like picnics on the sands, says Jane. They talk about the day they and lost their kite and how Jack and his friend helped them to find it. As shown in the picture, both Jane and Peter came to meet Jack and his friend. And they talked about the good time they had by the sea and the picnics and how they found their lost kite. Jack and his friend have been at the farm for some days now and they like it very much. They live in their tent. There has been no bad weather. The two boys help on the farm. They like to work out in the sun with Pam's father and his men. So Jack and his friend live at the farm in their tent and the weather has been good. Both the boys help Pam's father and his men with work as well. Peter and Jane come up to the farm again to see their friends. They ask them to make a log house. 
Why asks Jack? For us to play in, says Jane. Go on, it would be fun. We'd help you. So Peter and Jane come back to the farm to see their friends again and they ask them to make a log house for them to play in. Jack and his friend like to please Peter and Jane. So Jack and his friend like to please. Please means they want Peter and Jane to be happy. So they say they will make them a log house. First Jack looks at the logs and thinks. Then he says I know how to do it. Help me to push those big ones over here. So Jack says after looking at the logs that I know what to do but help me with the work. Pam's black puppy comes up to see what is going on. He wants to play. No says Jane to the puppy. We have work to do. Some little chicks come by and the puppy runs off after them. So Pam's black puppy comes and he wants to play with the children. But Jane says that we have work to do. So the puppy runs after the chicks. Jack and his friend make the log house for the children. They find an old door and put it into place. Jane wants the boys to know that she can ride. She rides entrance way in on the door when he sees this. Peter rides exit way out. Pam comes along. Has my puppy been here? She asks. Yes, says Jane. He came by here and then ran off to play with some chicks. He ran that way. I'll come with you to help to find him if you like. Peter talks to Jack. He says, you can swim very well and I like the way you dive into the water. I want to learn to dive like you. I can swim a little now. So, Jack and his friend have made the log house as you can see in the picture. And Jane wants to show that she can ride. So, she rides entrance way in as shown in the picture. And Peter rides exit way out on the other side of the door. Then, uh, Pam comes to find her puppy. And Jane tells that I can Go with you to find him. Peter talks to Jack and tells him to teach him how to swim because Peter likes how Jack dives and he swims. Jack says if you want to swim well, swim every day if you can. I live by the sea so I can swim every day. Jane comes back. Pam has found her puppy, she says. She plays in the log house with Peter until it is time to go home. So Jack tells that I swim every day. So you should also swim every day so that you can know swimming well as I do. And Jane comes back after finding the puppy and she plays with uh, Peter in the log house until it is time to go home. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And the questions uh, from today's video are, question number one is, Uh, for how many days Jack and his friend came to the farm? Question number two is 
what did they make out of the logs and question number three is what did Jane write on the door don't forget to mention the answers of your students or the readers in the comment section below I'll be looking forward to your answers and comments if you like the video Please do share and subscribe.